Do you have beard envy? Do you want your beard to look more like that, but it usually ends up looking more like this? Well, in today's video, I'm gonna give you five tips that are gonna make this look more like that. Hi Internet, my name's Drew, and I have a channel that's dedicated to helping other patchy beard growers achieve success. So if you've got a thin patchy beard, or you just like beards, follow me on my channel, Drew's Obsessions, as I grow this beard for the year. As you can probably tell, the guys over at Beard Brand have no trouble growing full thick beards, which is exactly why they wanted me to offer some advice from one patchy beard grower to another. Step number one. Before embarking on the quest for a full beard, you're gonna wanna find out if you have a fighting chance. As most of us already know, the biggest factor in determining whether or not your patchy beard is eventually gonna be full relies on your genetics. And although we can't change those, we can rely on our ancestors for hope. So you're gonna wanna start by looking through old photographs or talking to family members to figure out whether or not your ancestors have had full beards. If they have, then you have a good chance that your beard will eventually come in thicker. Number two, the easiest, yet the most challenging step is to let that scraggly mess on your face grow. Yes, I'm talking about your beard. Oh, it's gonna look ugly at times, but I beg you, do not cut anything. Hold off on cutting for as long as you can, especially your mustache. In my opinion, growing your mustache is grossly underestimated. You can definitely use it and shape it so that it covers up bald spots, and it's gonna give an overall girth to your beard that you wouldn't otherwise have. Which leads me to my next step. Number three, training your beard. You're gonna need to start training your beard. It sounds silly, doesn't it? Let's take the hair on the top of your head, for example. The more you comb it in one direction, the more likely it is that your hair is gonna naturally fall in that direction. The same goes for your beard. So when you get out of the shower, try to stop fluffing your beard up with your towel and start directing it in the way you want your hair to start to flow. And a boar bristle brush is a must. In my opinion, it's looking better already. Okay, so you've done some research and your genetics show you have a chance. You're growing it out, spindly as it is, and you've been combing it every day, three times a day, but it still just doesn't look very good. In comes step number four. Now's the time for some product. I like to use a variety of beard products to make my beard look healthy and full, starting with a good quality beard oil. that up with some beard balm and then I use some styling clay to increase the thickness. A good quality clay is going to stick to each individual hair giving the illusion that it's much thicker than it actually is. And for some added hold you might want to try some hairspray. Once it dries it will allow you to shape your beard in different directions and cover up any weak spots that you have. And number five, my last and final piece of advice. You're going to need to start to make some alterations to your lifestyle. And I know that sounds very open-ended but by changing little things like the amount of exercise you're getting and the foods that you're eating are gonna help to increase your hair growth. Regular exercise is gonna help to reduce stress and increase hair growth. And by reducing the amount of processed foods and unhealthy foods in your diet means you're gonna be upping all those good nutrients and it's gonna give your beard the chance to grow to its full potential. Well, I hope that helped. Thanks for watching. Thanks to Beard Brand for hosting. And for more tips and tricks, follow my 365 day beard growing journey at Drew's Obsessions. Now that you've made it to the end of the video, go ahead and treat yourself to some fine Beard Brand products over on our shop. If you're not already a subscriber, be sure to do that. And finally, Keep on watching some more of our awesome videos.